Okay, ladies and gentlemen, it is that time again. Meter readings. <laughs> Don't you just love being a grown-up? One of my favourite things to do because I love spiders. I love them so much. And there's so many of them in here. Oh my god. Believe it or not, it's actually a, a good time for me to do it because I think, obviously with bills and all that going up, um, if I get this sorted, like, well, now, um, pretty much, just type it in there. If I get this sorted now, I should be able to get my bill down a bit, so that's good. It takes like five minutes, realistically, it's just annoying. Never really understand about companies, especially people like energy companies and, well, like, well, just companies in general. It's like, make it as easy as possible for me to pay you, and I will pay you. Why, like, why do they make things difficult? I don't understand. It's like bills just in general. It's like surely these companies want to make it as easy as possible for people like us, regular people, to just give them our money. Because that is essentially what we do. It's not even essentially what we do. It is what we do. We give them our money. <laughs> Obviously, yes, in return for stuff like energy and gas. I get it, right? But, you know, it's just annoying. Anyway, what's up? Well, it seems there's the first time for everything, ladies and gentlemen. My microphone is playing up. So, basically, what I'm saying here is, what's up, guys? Liam here. Highly requested video coming at you today. Please, drop it a like. Drop it a comment down below. Subscribe if you are new. And then something about paying your own bills and being an adult and all that kind of stuff. Um, but anyway, apologies for that. I think my mic might be broken. Thank you so much for tuning in today. I appreciate you all. Let's do this. It's a deadlift party today. Not for us, not for me and Sai. Uh, obviously I've been training with Sai for a little while. We're filming a video about the importance of a training plan. Uh, stay tuned on the UFB page for that, maybe next week or the week after. Uh, depends on when we decide to schedule it. So, it's a deadlift party, like I say. Myself and Sai not deadlifting at the minute. I was actually kind of getting into it a little bit uh, with Ricky, who's gonna go for a 300 kilo deadlift today. Um, casual, you know, just as you do. That may be on the agenda for me one day. Today is not that day, however, Today is the day to progress. All of the other frigging lifts that we've been doing, we're benching, we're incline benching, we're doing everything that we have been doing. Like I say, the importance of following a training plan, we're gonna be doing that down to a T today in the same order, same exercises, same rep ranges, everything. And it's working, guys. I'll show you a physique update over the next couple of weeks or so, but it's going good. It's going real good. Drop this video a like if you have not already. Let's keep going. Easy. Power. Enjoy. And again. Get it on. Uh, Come on. 
Strong, come on. Yeah, we're flying, we're flying, come on. Good, yeah. save it, save it, save it. Mm. Fucking Good. take that. Let's go. Ah, come on then. Come on, let's go. Don't stop. You can it's do it. Stop. Three fucking twenty next week, motherfuckers. So over the past what month, six weeks, six weeks. Like that, about six weeks now, basically 2022. Um, I've been following the same plan as the boss man behind the camera right now. Now, you guys may not have seen how it looked before, how it looked in January or anything like that. Over the past six weeks, we've gotten stronger, we've gotten bigger, and I would say I've gotten a little bit leaner as well. Um, basically, kind of just brought back a little bit of the post concussion um, physique, and I will put a lot of that down to. Well, all of that down to following the same exercises on the same days, in the same order, with the boss man. It's as simple as that. So without that, I would have been coming in going willy-nilly on, oh, I fancy a bit of this machine today, or oh, maybe do some tricep extensions, all that kind of stuff. Like, I would have followed roughly the same kind of thing, because I kind of get drawn to the same machines. I love this one here, like the Atlantis decline. But, coming in and doing the exact same things to the point where I can say, right, we're doing this next, we're doing that next, and you just kind of learn the routine. Consistent routine. routine. It's the, yeah, it's the consistency over the time, over the weeks, um, and just every single day, even with the reps, you know, recording them, all that kind of stuff. Obviously, I do my own things as well, so I record my sets for, for myself and for the gym channel. So, all of that combined into one. Progress. It's working. It's working, it's big time. Big time working, working big and time. And you're stronger now for the more than ever. I, so. I probably am. To be honest, like, I've Not never benched that before. I've never benched. Um, like, I've done four sets of five on 100 kilos, which is baby weight to some, I know. But for me, that's that's big, isn't it? Like, I've, well. I've never done that amount of volume and that amount of reps um, on bench. So all good. Winning. We are winning right now. Let's keep it going. On the video. Right. It's kind of fun, you know, progressing every single week, following the same exercises every single week. Because I would have done it loosely beforehand, myself on side. Uh, I've always kind of done similar exercises. To run through the session so far, we did. 100 kilos, but not three sets of five, four sets of five today. Four sets of five on 100 kilos. You guys know how gassed I was when I hit that for one bounce of a rep. They were all paused, my bum was flat. It's progress, people. It's baby weight to some, I realise that, but it's progress. Fuck concussion. Fuck concussion. I cannot tell you how happy it makes me to feel like this, you know, to, to be training, doing what I love. This right here, what you're watching, is my two favourite things in one go. Filming and training. Editing and training, however you want to put it, my two favourite things in one go. That is what I get to do every single time I walk through these fucking doors here at USB, and it genuinely means the world to me. I, it makes me so happy. <sighs> and it's all I want to do all day, every day. So, let's keep it going. So that is the session for the day done. A very, very, very successful one. Pretty much PBs all round, to be fair, for myself and Sai. It's just very motivating being surrounded by people that are progressing every single week, that are just, that just have a, a good mindset. They understand my unfortunate need for, for rest every now and then when it comes to the whole concussion thing, but also know when to push me at the same time. It's just the best environment for me to be in. It, it, it just is, it makes, me, it makes me very happy. So thank you to all supporting me, not just people at the gym. You know who you are, thank you. But with that said, it is time to go back to the flat, get some grub, and, 
Oh, I was gonna say something else as well. I got some pre-workout gummies. We're gonna have an entire video coming on that very soon, but I'm gonna get Sai involved. I'm gonna film it next time. It's gonna be good. So this is what we have for dinner, ladies and gentlemen. We have some chicken breast. We have some butternut and pat choy stir fry. Sorry if I've butchered that. Um, a stir fry mix. I'm basically gonna put a couple of these chicken breasts in. Um, throw that in the pan as well. Uh, maybe mix in some of this as well, just to kind of pad it out a little bit. Uh, and I'll have it for two meals. Uh, obviously one chicken breast being kind of the equivalent for one meal. Uh, I'll only want half of this anyway. So half and half. Uh, and then the entire, well, half per meal, I guess, of this. Um, and that's gonna be dinner. So. I'll show you guys what that looks like, but that is going to be it for today's video, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to be cooking it in this pan because I need a wok. I haven't got a wok. Um, if I'm going to, I really like stir fries. I cook stir fries a lot. Um, pretty low calorie, pretty good for you, high protein if you put enough chicken or beef or whatever in. But very rarely actually um, show you guys in anything that, that I cook. So I'm going to start doing that in the near future. I'm gonna go shopping, uh, food shopping, show you guys what I pick up on a daily. That's my phone. Hello, one second, priorities. One thing I want to focus on is my, my diet, um, showing you guys how I'm improving my diet, what, what kind of changes I'm making to my diet, the things, that, the habits that I'm putting in place in order to maximize or optimize, I should say, basically everything in my life, not just my diet, um, training, sleep, Everything, literally everything. Um, this year, 2022, I'm really gonna get on top of on, on top of my shit, basically. Over the past few weeks, I've kind of learned things that I need to do moving forwards, um, things that I need to kind of change, things that I need to keep the same, and the things that I need to do, basically, to make everything that I do on a daily basis in my life, both professionally and personally, um, a hell of a lot easier. So, pretty much, I'm gonna show you guys as much of that as I possibly can over the next few weeks. So stay tuned, drop a like if you have not already. Subscribe if you are new and you are looking forward to said new content. Let me know what you wanna see me make next in the comment section down below. I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. If you have, do me a massive favor, drop it a like, comment down below, subscribe if you are new. I appreciate every single one of you. My protein stuff coming just around the corner. It's gonna be a friggin' sick year. Let's make it a good one, everyone. January is gone, February is here. Let's smash it, I just hit my bag. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all, I appreciate you all, and I will see you in the next one. Dinner time!